Kakak bye bye terus mereka This is how full my laundry basket is so we need to get something done about that because I am not happy with that Okay, so hey guys, uh, today I am going to go get my glasses. My glasses actually came out way earlier than I thought because they told me that I was gonna get them after 21 days 10 days didn't even hit and already like I got a call let's see your glasses are already boo boo so yeah I'm gonna go get my glasses and I am thinking of also going to uh, Mr. Price as well because um, on my birthday I actually got Mr. Price vouchers and then I went and spent most of it I spent most of them okay well I finished one and I spent majority of the other one so I need to finish that other half of it you need got some stuff and I'm really thinking of just using it and finishing it all at once because what am I still waiting for you know what I mean plus like those vultures expire quite quickly so like I don't want to waste time and chill because I'm not a person who regularly goes to the mall I don't like going to the mall guys I don't like going to the mall like it's not something that I like doing I don't enjoy it I don't like going to the mall I just mm -mm. I'm really nervous about seeing how my new glasses look quite anxious not excited but I'm quite anxious but I'm just really hoping that I'll love them approximately 10 hours later so I got my glasses from Spec Savers by Burr. Let me show you how. how mm, let me show you how my glasses look. Da -da -da, da -da -da -da. Okay, let me open it. My glasses look baby, bye bye. bye. Look at how my glasses, guys. I shout out to these ones because they have kept me through it. But anyways, now on to the new ones. I love, 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 love the frame. Like I said, like this frame is actually smaller than this one, if you can tell. But yeah, overall, I have no regrets whatsoever. Chosen a frame, I chose a lovely frame. So I pretty much got some snacks. Let me just get those out. I start things off. I actually got water from for me and pops, so I drank that already because it's it was too hot. I got these beautiful beauty blenders because I needed that. Also, like I actually ended up not knowing what to blow my money on because. Um, yeah i've been chilling with this voucher guys like i spent um, money and yeah so i just decided to like use the rest all on accessories but anyways you'll see what i'm talking about so i got beauty blenders because i need those i left them the first time and i was just like let me get them today <laughs> scrunchies for my hair since my hair is relaxed i'm quite happy that i got these so yeah i'm able to play around with color and they are a lot plus there was a markdown on them so needed those also got these beautiful hair tie i mean hair clips <laughs> Whoa, head lips. I think they're quite beautiful, but yeah. I ended up getting this white vest because I need one. The last one that I had, I guess she's saying it was a mistake though, but yeah, I just needed I just need a white top so because it is a staple. So this um animal print body contrast as well because um I need 
a thick beautiful woman like me needs a bodycon dress obviously so yeah i got that even though i'm not i don't have natural hair anymore but i got these hair what do they call these i don't know what they call these but yeah these i don't know hair ties they're not called hair ties but i don't know what they're called i don't know what's the name for this guys i don't know but yeah i just really got these to tie my hair because i'm tired and also apparently these are actually good because they don't tug on your hair i also pretty much got this um white pearly this white pearly hairband because um i actually found one that belonged to my older sister when i was visiting my grandparents place because she left it there and then since then i was just like oh i love her hairband i need to get my own so yeah i just got my own hairband so yeah got some watermelon super c's as well if you guys watch my vlogs then you tell that i wear the most simplest necklaces ever so this is i don't know um yeah i just really decided to just i feel like it's also kind of like a staple when it comes to jewelry so i just decided to get it because i didn't know what else to get and the other necklaces come with uh, studs i don't wear studs so yeah i just decided to take this and i wear a lot of black and i think that this will match well with the black what i forgot to show you guys is this it's not really a jacket I got this for 260 um i got it in small because the sizing was a bit big i can't even imagine what smaller people experience with mr price bro like yeah so i got this in small and likely this was the only size left there was also a brown one as well i wanted to take the brown but uh... so hey guys uh it's a different day of course i uh, just came here to show you guys how i look with my glasses this is how i actually look with my new glasses i love them i love them i love them i was a bit skeps though when i got them i was just like <laughs> okay when i was trying out the frame on the day because i was really tired that day guys i was just like i'm not trying out all these frames i'm sorry but like i'm not gonna do it and i know that there probably was like a frame that i loved more than this one but i i was just tired i got to spec save quite late that day you know? i was just tired i was not in the mood i was just my mood was just so it's just like you know what i had two frames but i knew that my next frame was going to be a clear frame but anyways that's not what i wanted to show okay i did want to show you how i look with my new glasses of course love them love them like it's a king it's a king like you can tell like i look so pretty dang that's not what i came here to tell you guys i came here to show you guys what my sister got me i think today was like the first time yeah for like i think i've probably been sitting with this box for like close to a week it's about to hit a week close to a week it's honestly so close to a week where i've been sitting with this box and yeah so i obviously did open the shoes and i just put them back <laughs> because my life was just a little bit busy and yeah i was a little bit all over the place so i want to show you these cute kicks that my sister got me so let me show you there this is what the box looks like and then when you open oh love 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 they are so cute we gave them a name and we called them uh cotton candy my sister said you know what when i saw these i knew that this was you and since you love wearing crop tops these are going to be the perfect shoes for you so yeah she just said that these are going to be the perfect shoes for you i love them guys you know what hey yeah keep yeah keep i definitely recommend having a sister but but yeah my sister got me these and yeah i haven't worn them i'm gonna wear them quite soon but i just wanted to show you guys before i remove these from the box that's pretty much all that i wanted to show you today literally because like if i didn't i don't I actually wanted to show you guys my glasses as well because i really don't want to start another vlog and be like oh this is how my glasses look and i mean well what i'm trying to say is i just didn't want the vlogging to progress without me showing you guys my glasses like if i never got to if uh, if i had never gotten the chance to show you guys right now then i don't think that i would have gotten the chance to show you guys ever again Whew. english okay right now i need to also go for more video i haven't had time for youtube 
I haven't had time for anything. Like I haven't had time for myself. Right now I think it's pretty much the perfect time to actually film. I'm really worried about the lighting though. But um, I'm going to go for a quick video. Edit it. Yeah, so I'll see you guys on a different day. I just really need to push content like these um these um days i just really need to push content that's just all i'm trying to say i need to push content i haven't had time to push content and i really don't like feeling like i'm slacking i don't like that i don't like feeling like i'm slacking but yeah even if it happens that i do angry guys like it's him <laughs> I think we better like that anyways morning guys okay so we're back to the real thing anyways don't mind me i just woke up in fact the delivery guy woke me up gone bro i was gone but luckily i don't feel tired it's very early in the morning though like very 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 early it's very early and i got like a package before i took the bath because yeah i was fast asleep and this delivery guy called me anyways that's why you should never leave your phone off when you are sleeping. I wanna show you guys this package. Don't like, you know, I just wanna really show you guys before I actually get dressed and start with my day. So I wanna show you guys what we got. Okay, so I actually put my diary on top of my address and my information. Yeah, I put my journal on top of my address and my information, but this is what I got. It looks very big. I don't know what to expect though, because I don't know. I, I don't know what's in it really matter i hope this is mine i really hope it's mine because i also don't know what's inside but i hope it's mine but yeah i just got this and we're gonna unbox it quick i really hope that this is mine because like if it's not then that's gonna be so anyways i really hope that this is mine if it isn't then it's gonna be awkward it's really gonna be i hope this is mine dude there's no way that they can mix up addresses also i need to wash my hair yo today Ugh, I need to wash my hair. I'm gonna cut this up quick, quick. Also, I don't mind my pajamas, guys. I feel like everyone should have cartoon PJs. Like, uh, yeah. it seems like there's a lot of things inside. <laughs> I just saw this boy and I started screaming but like now I'm just asking myself is this really for me? Let me open this bro like whoever no this is mine this is mine this is mine this is a bow bro eh serious things okay let's open this bro like let me Now I'm skeptical to actually unwrap this further because I feel like it's gonna give a hint uh, like where this is from. Anyways, um, let's just do that. Let me be in my element. Let me open this up and okay. 
Ugh, and this bowl was properly ripped for, I mean, properly done. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, <laughs> I might have to open it like this. <laughs> okay, now I can't show you the package anymore, but yeah. One eternity later. Okay, hey guys. So today is obviously Saturday, and me and my sister we are off to the Sweater Gotta Festival. Oh, I love Gotas. I don't know when my Gotta addiction started. <sighs> Let me move to the light room. But it's here. Uh, I made my hair into like a low bun, called it a day really. I don't want to blab a lot. I'm not taking my camera with me because I'm not fun to risk that. But yeah, let's go. The time now is like two started at 12 it ends at 7 so yeah we get I, yeah we oh my ears are so red i was having a tough time inserting these earrings but anyways gotta go hope you enjoyed the vlog i'm not gonna vlog much today like i just want to chill like Paula, like so yeah I just want to show you guys how my shoes look. Okay, guys, um, I'm actually back home. First and foremost, I want to say good to So, we took a bit of all. Let me tell you guys the story. Today, I was planning on vlogging on my phone, but then my attempt was kind of unsuccessful because, let me tell you, so me and my sister left the crib, Gabo uh, Matu, right? Because the festival started at 12. So we're like, okay, we left at 2, we got that thing at half 2. Nah, I'm lying. Yeah, we got the half 2. Nah, my sister's like, last on get on with 4. When we entered, when we get, got to the gate, go away. It was packed, guys. It was packed. Firstly, there was no form of management to say, okay, people who are buying tickets at the door, stand here. People who have already bought tickets, come here. Next. Guys, the line that we were in, I th we spent like two hours outside trying to get in. Anyways, as I was still saying, right? I We get there. Hey, getting in is a struggle, my brother. Like, I do not even want to touch on the topic of getting in. We spent two hours at the gate 
guys and already inside because like where the parking is it's like higher up so you need it you, you have to like go down so basically it slants for you to go to where um the whole event is so obviously when you're still by the parking walking down you get the overview of like it was packed inside guys i'm telling you there was no capacity limitations there like packed eventually um we enter no? obviously guys when you're gonna enter like in a festival there's supposed to be that person or scanner like i'm a ticket and giving you tags right that's what i'm used to uh -uh. we get there when we get to the gate they're telling us okay get in and then there's just only two people who are handing out tags and it's not even a table dude there's no form of order next like this person this guy they keep following him people are complaining goes how is it that you're taking our tickets but you don't want to give us a tag you know what i mean like you're taking the tickets but you're not giving us a tag Jaini. people started fighting from there next thing people are pushing each other we get there we get the tags we put the tags on eventually we get in my sister's again guys obviously there's that level of excitement to go say okay my sister's like my god we got in i think at half past four if i'm not mistaken got in at half past four we got there too got in at half past four must be again now obviously guys like naki cherry akokasi like i really love like um food from the hood you know because like i mean you know what i mean obviously i'm just trying to because one thing about me guys if you follow me on tiko you know that i love quarters like nah nah i love a quarter i don't want to lie to you now obviously me coming to this event i'm excited because i'm just like i want to see like who's the best of the best you know what i mean like i can't travel throughout the whole of soto guys like i don't want to lie it really makes it hard like okay shop when i visit and you know it's easy for me to say ah oh, let me go try it got that speech or whatever <laughs> you know what i mean like it's so easy when I got to this festival, I was like, obviously, at least now I'm getting the opportunity to be able to try out these different quarters from like different hoods, you know, all in one. Like, I want to try out different stuff. <sighs> Firstly, every single tent has massive lines, guys. Lines. I'm not like <laughs> lines, dude. Where there's drinks, there's lines. Like, I was just there, like, what is going on? Another thing is, I was carrying this bigger umbrella because it's so hot guys like i told my sister do we not gonna survive there in the stadium just chilling with nothing aha do we not gonna survive now i'm carrying this huge ass umbrella because obviously i told myself because obvious dude we got there too maybe so and probably by then you know it's not gonna be like a hassle for us to get our food and then we're gonna chill by ourselves like on blanket chill and jesse be right you know Eventually, like we joined lines, my sister starts telling me that she's hungry. Because obviously, when you go to a quarter festival, you're gonna go there hungry, belly, you know. I must have figured again. We ended up eating. Uh, we ended up ordering food from a chili pepper, and I was honestly mad because there was like another table. Where I was telling my sister, go to like I really wanted to try food from there. So when she went to go check, there like waiting time is thirty minutes. Ask me what time it is freaking half past four dude we've been we got in there half past four the time was like five my sister eventually goes to order the drinks while i'm still in the line for the god right so like i'm looking at this food i'm like yo i really want to order from these ladies so she's telling me waiting time is 35 minutes i'm like dude there's no way my sister comes back she's like where they selling drinks but he they closing now at five i'm like we just got here as i'm in the line i'm hearing people saying that other stores don't like are out of stock they, there's no place where there's chips and stuff like that like they basically starting a, like from scratch to actually prepare the quarters what about Gerardi Tapole all of it guys like from scratch dude I'm just like dude we hungry I can't wait that long I can't. <laughs> no seriously that's how I felt inside eventually like I was really forced to buy a Kotaku chili pepper and I didn't want to guys because like I was trying to try out food from different places like literally like that was the whole main aim of the festival for you to try different guys i kid you not it was so packed in that festival like ah me and my sister only got to where like the performances were happening at six we didn't even take pictures today dude we never took pictures today we never did nothing 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 like i promise you guys from this footage that i gave you guys that is all that happened like come on like what's that nana yeah, yeah. Like, sorry, she <laughs> yeah uh, excuse me. Me nangzama here. Me na. 
Who? I need to get this hand. Who said that? That camera guy, maybe someone else. Dog, how many camera people? Camera, these camera niggas, I'm telling you. I'm telling you, I'm tired. Yo, I wouldn't want to shoot at you. I'm shooting mint. Let's not count. Okay. <laughs> yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Go ready, go to first. How was it? Out of 10. Um. Out of ten, like the experience and yeah, the vibe, all of it. Vibe was nine. Yeah, nine out of um, ten for food vibe. Food was, I mean, food was chili pepper. Chili pepper is uh, something I've had before. Four. Mm. So I would say eight out of ten. Food. Okay. Are you gonna give it how many? How much? What is the rate as what? Probably six. Six seven five eight, five eight. and a half of six. Yeah. Okay, six seven. Seven. Seven, okay. Seven. Mm -hmm. I've had better honestly. Yeah. Food, food bars. Food bars. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. Um, yeah. What do you wanna say? Um, the whole experience total. The whole everything Overall, overall yeah. I feel like they uh, they the they shouldn't have changed the location. Mm -hmm. Um first impressions, I'm not impressed. Not impressive. It's the, it's the bottom get her. Get her. Get her. Yeah. Just e e e vibe control. Yeah. They never had control True. of the place. Mm. And there was a lot the, of people. The, the, the ticket process Pro was horrible. Horrible. It, it was non existent actually. It was the worst. It was non existent. Mm. I don't know why. But um, yeah, they should fix that because it's a problem. Yeah. And they should limit have people. Limit people. Mm. Like if 5,000 is. 5,000 is 5,000. Yeah. I think it's quite a day. How if tickets are sold out? Yeah. But they were they they screened, they brought they want everything, in, and it was full to Your max capacity. Next time they shouldn't allow kids. Yeah, they should make it eighteen and older. They shouldn't allow kids. Because kids are getting lost. Kids they. Yo. Were they? Kids, kids are getting, getting lost. lost. Right and parents, parents are drunk. getting drunk. So, so disaster. Nah, oh, they should be yeah, eighteen and up. Yeah, eighteen and, they should, and they up. They should have maybe an event for strictly kids. Yeah, like, and like then maybe playing music and music and everyone leads. Yeah. yeah, but um, other than that, it's it's a great concept. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, it's, it's really just that it's just management. preparation and management. Yeah, it's 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 a negative zero. Yeah, you heard it here first. Anyways. Yeah. Thanks for watching guys. See also I just also want to say good to shout out to Chili Pepper guys. That was the only store that was literally operating. Okay, there was other stores as well. But like I heard this other lady coming to go buy there by Chili Pepper and she was like, This is the only store that has chips. Every other store sold out. Or no chips or whatever. Chili Pepper's work ethic on one shame. I don't wanna lie. <laughs> Thanks for watching guys. See you in the next vlog. Bye. Bye. Yeah.